Kentucky bourbon is, is extremely special. Um, not only is it a signature industry here, it's been made here for about 250 years. People understand worldwide the quality, the respect for bourbon that we have here in Kentucky. My name is Drew Colesveen, and I'm the master distiller at Willow Distillery. Bourbon is something very close to my heart. Our family's been making it for about five generations. It's in our blood. You know, one of the most important things that you have that's your own is your name and your reputation and what you do with it. Hey, I'm Britt. I'm from Bardstown, Kentucky, bourbon capital of the world, and America's most beautiful small town, y'all. We are one of the last few remaining independently family-owned and operated distilleries left. They started distilling on St. Patrick's Day in 1937. They did about 300 bushels of corn that day, which was the equivalent of 30 barrels. Um, to this day, we're doing on average about 21 barrels a day, so we're actually smaller in size today. We've committed to staying small. That allows us to keep our quality uh, and maintain a certain level of production that you tend to lose a lot of the nuance as things get bigger and bigger. We have one bottling line and one shift, and on a good day, we maybe have 15 to 20 people working on it. It's thoroughly handmade, and Everyone takes great pride in what they do. We're able to control the direction and flavor of our, our whiskey in the way that we feel is necessary for our brands and for our, our customers. What we make here, our, the, the bourbon and rye, represent a lot of different things. Our, our family heritage is very important to me and, and keeping that tradition alive is, is very important to our family. We're producing traditional recipes that our family has been producing for five generations and new recipes that I developed. So in terms of a profile, uh, you're, you're still going to get a lot of the, the traditional flavors, but we really want to accentuate the flavoring grain, which is either the rye or the wheat that we use in our recipes. We really want you to taste uh, the essence of that grain. We're able to use local farms for our grain, and I really like being able to have part of the local community involved in our process. One of the things that I love too about us that's so unique is our pot still. It's a patented design that my father did, so there is no other still like it in this entire world. The Willet Pot Still Reserve is our signature bourbon that we, that we make here at Willet. We took the blueprints from that still and had a uh, glass company in Italy create the bottle for us. And it's very distinctive. It stands out from the crowd. We're very proud to put our family name on that unique product. One of the few things that's so unique to us that I just love is that a lot of our whiskey is non-chill filtered. It's cast strength, which means it is literally raw whiskey straight out of the barrel. What you see behind me is our Willett Family Estate uh, collection. It is the most inconsistent bourbon brand on the market. We're very proud of, of that. It was really eye-opening at the time. People weren't really allowing you to do that. They had a brand and they wanted a single barrel to fit that profile within some restraints. We didn't want that. We wanted people to come here and pick something unique. The most important thing to me is when people come here, you know, they feel at home because this is our home. To see the joy that it brings people, to hear the stories of when they first had a sip of Willet or a Willet product and what it, what it meant to them is, is really inspiring to me. I have never wanted to be everyone's cup of tea, but I only need to be one person's sip of whiskey.